we are opening uh, some fun ones because I, ha I have a lot that I have to open and I've been trying to space them out especially because it stops me from sometimes it kind of okay it doesn't really but it does help spacing it out so I don't buy like a ton uh, because I can like see a pile of stuff I still have to open with that being said I do have 12 battle styles ATBs on the way so I will be opening at least eight of them which will be fun uh, and I ordered two champions path ETBs uh, for about like 120 total I think 120 130 something like that and then a little bit of tax and stuff like that so a uh, pretty decent deal so I'm happy about that um, but yeah I've been saving these guys for a while now so we're gonna start with dream league and we're gonna open shining star V um, and before anyone gets mad just know I will be saving one pack from each of these or sorry two packs from the five card one um, to put in my personal collection I have saved a box of each of these but it's fun to save like just the packs as well that way I can do like a full box break later blah 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 I explain it almost every video uh, with new stuff I like to save cards uh, card packs uh, as a collector so it pains me as much as it does other people but anyway dream league I actually don't even know what's in this set I've opened a tag team GX before um, I was gonna look up there I moved all my Pokemon stuff I don't remember which one it was it's my letter opener lethal weapon oh my god And then Walmart, admire this uh, box art here. It's got a, a lot going on. Got Cliff, Cliff Fable, I know that one. I can't remember. Got Gardevoir, I think. Magneton. Is it like Sneevile? Sweezel? Swiss, Swiss, I don't remember it right. Oh, camera focus. Oh god, it got worse. Okay. <laughs> Ride shoot. Do you have teeth? What's going on there? No. Okay. It's just shadowed weird. Uh, and an oddish. I thought it was going to be like a Sonic situation. Ooh, I always have trouble opening these boxes. Oh, that wasn't that bad. Ooh hoo! These packs look fancy. All right. What I kind of like, I kind of like and I don't like about the five pack ones is there's so many in the box. So many. It's just so many packs to open, which is fun for opening. It's not fun for a video because it takes forever. Anyway, let's see. Let's just shuffle these up a little bit without ruining the cards. And I'll just take two at random oh jeez those are five card packs and set them aside for the collection all right now we gotta clear some space that I I really don't have space right now all right Hashtag not sponsored by Popeyes. All right. Pokemon cards. Kind of sucks that these don't have code cards in them. Do any of the Japanese cards have code cards? Is it just a, like a US thing? It's a lot I don't know about Pokemon. But we're learning we're learning I also don't know the order so we're just gonna flip it and we're gonna find out 
I think it's in order. I don't, I don't think I have to change anything. So we got coughing. I still don't know his name. It's like Sweezel Sneevile, Drill Burr. Oh, oh ho ho, the GX already. So it's one to the front or is this still my rare? See, that's what I don't know. I think, I think this is my rare. So GX already off the bat. Pretty nice, pretty nice. I know the Japanese cards generally give you a hit. I could be wrong, but I think in most cases you are pretty much guaranteed to get some good hits from the uh, Poke from the Japanese version. All right, already off to a good start. Just put those guys right there, and we'll keep opening more. Let me see. Let me see if I can get some type of soft music going. We'll do something like that. So we'll try one to the front until all of a sudden, I get something good in the front. I, I don't know. Torkoal? I'm really guessing some of these names. Piplup? Because I don't know all of them, I'm going to be honest. I know that one. It's Charizard. Oh, yeah. So we did get pretty lucky with that GX. So we got Hollow. What is his name? Oh, I, I know it. But I don't know it. So I don't know. Hollow something. Look at that Pikachu though. That'd be sick, Hollow. We need that one. We need that one, Hollow. So tired today. I tried to run around and just see if I could happen upon some Pokemon cards. I got. Uh, let me let me run you through <laughs> the day I tried to have. First of all, I tried to plan on being at open at like a Walmart and Target. That didn't happen. I woke up so late. But what I ended up doing is I went to a TJ Maxx. Because I heard TJ Maxx can have Pokemon cards. So if you didn't know that, you're welcome. Don't know where they were, and I feel weird about asking people, like, hey, where's your Pokemon cards? I'm a grown man, and I want to know where your Pokemon cards are. So I just didn't ask. I didn't find them, so I left. Um... Went to TJ Maxx, then I went to the Hobby Lobby next to me, because I've heard Hobby Lobby has Pokemon cards. Same thing there. Didn't ask where they were supposed to be. Didn't see any. Left. I uh, went to Target just on the happenstance. A lot of people say, like, sometimes they just happen upon a restock. So there's a Target in the same parking lot. I figured, what the hell? I'm here. Might as well. Nothing. Then I went to... I think I went to a Dollar Tree that was also in the same parking lot. Nothing. Just a whole lot of nothing. The whole parking lot had four stores that had Pokemon cards. Nothing. Then I went like a town over uh, to a Fred Meyer, which my buddy says that that Fred. Oh, a full art. Is that wishy washy or. Right? It's just, it's just a wishy-washy with a... Uh, oh, and an Empoleon. Wishy-washy with... When they all combine together. I don't think there's a word for it. I don't know. That's really cool, though. That looks cool. This is a sick card. Um. Anyway. Yeah, I went to a Fred Meyer. I guess since they don't keep it near the lanes, like in most Fred Meyers, it's back in the entertainment section. Not a lot of people go to it. I was like, oh, cool. So I just went there just to see if they had any. They didn't. They had, like, there was garbage pail kids or something like that cards. I was really confused. Um, got nothing there. <laughs> and then I went to a Barnes & Noble. Because a lot of people have had good pulls. Uh, good luck with Barnes & Noble. And I go in. 
and I didn't know where they were. Like, I was in the toy section, and I didn't see Pokemon cards, but I also didn't see any, like, Funko Pops. I was like, I, there must be a different section in this one. Like, it might be rearranged. Weird. And so I asked a lady, I'm like, hey, do, you know, do you have any Pokemon cards in stock? Do you happen to have any Pokemon cards in stock? Like, just asking as innocently as possible. And then she says no. Like, they're all sold out. And I was like, okay, well, I'm at Barnes & Noble. I like Barnes & Noble. Let me go browse around. I haven't been on Barnes & Noble for a little bit. I'm going to go browse around and see what I can find. Comic book wise and things like that. Well, I stumble upon the magic section. So I was like, oh, well, if there's going to be Pokemon cards, they'd be over here. <laughs> so I uh, look in the section and there, there is, there is uh, four booster packs three vivid voltage one battle styles just in a little locked case so i'm like oh okay i'm just gonna grab this then maybe the lady didn't know so i grab that i wander around for a little bit i go to the register with like a couple comic books and the little sealed thing and the guy was like how many out of this do you want and i was like uh i mean all of them unless you have a limit and he's like oh no <laughs> and i was like cool all the four Pokemon cards. All of them were green cards. I did get an amazing rare Celebi. It's two, like two amazing rare uh, Celebis now. Um, so that was fun. That was out of the first pack I got. Everything else, these Japanese packs, everything else wasn't that great. But um, I always forget that, like, even though it's a green card, the reverse holo spot can still have, like, amazing rares and things like that. So, oh my god. Am I going to have to cut this pack? What is happening? Ow. All right. Bring it out. Bring out the scissors. So I can't figure it out. Um. Yeah. So not great. But I did get an amazing rare Celebi, which on the high end, I think sold for 150, 170 or something like that. It really only goes for like... 15 20 bucks on a, like a normal market but on the high it was like 170 so it's cool to have two of them for sure i'm getting a lot of the uh same card for the hollow yeah i can't remember his name off the top man i'm terrible with pokemon names Honestly, like if I can't read, oh, GX, there we go. There we go. Not super great, but GX nonetheless. Um, I'm pretty bad with, with Pokemon names, I'm gonna be honest. I could up my Pokey knowledge. So it's hard though, there's a lot and I, only played the sun and moon game like a little bit like I, I beat it but i didn't do much of the end game content uh, i honestly i definitely did not catch them all so definitely and it's been a while honestly that came out so long ago i was still the ds game r.i.p the ds dude R.I.P. Pokemon's cards. They're so hard to open. There we go. I feel like it's just me. Hey, if you're watching this on YouTube and you've opened... Japanese cards. Let me know. Oh! Oh! It's like Soul. What is his name? Solo Leo? I think that's what it is. Solo Leo and Lunala. Tag Team GX. Nice. Nice. That's, that's kind of nice. That's a nice pull. I don't know what it's worth, but it's cool. I mean, those are the box legendaries. They have to be, they have to be worth something, right? Um, anyway, if you're watching on YouTube, let me know if you also have trouble with 
Japanese cards as much as I do. I have, I have trouble. Oh, oh God. Back in my day. Dude, my drink be sweating everywhere. Torque hole. Sneak file. Caffeine. Trainer. Wait. Oh, wait. It's coming to me. I don't know. I know. That, I think this one's called, like, Lil Tund? Lil Tund? Nope. I should stop guessing. I have no clue. I do not know. Why is my camera shaking so much? That card go. Oh my god, it just came to me. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! Steelix? Wait. Wait, hold up. Hold the phone. It says 60 out of 49. What is this card? I need to know. I must know. CHR? What does that mean? What does that mean? What does it mean? Uh, let me pull. Let's pull up. Oh gosh, I can't reach. Okay. Okay, Lecter. I have a bookmark. I don't know why I started. Let me see. Let me see. Uh, Japanese sets. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, which one do we pull from? Dream League, Sun and Moon. Mm -mm -mm. 60, 60, 60. Steelix. Secret rare. Oh, okay. So it's just, okay, it's just a secret rare. <coughs> 3,400 yen. It's not very much. What is that, like, four dollar no that doesn't sound right hey google what's the conversion of three thirty four hundred yen to dollars oh 30 yeah okay thirty dollars i see that's not bad a s secret rare this card is sick. Okay, I need to sleeve it. My sweat hands be all over it. I was really just confused because of like the little stars on it. I thought for some reason this was a like a shiny card. I was like, he looks the same. I don't remember what. That's really cool. I'm gonna put that right there. Secret rare, boys. I just realized. No, okay, that's that's numbered. That's awesome. Oh my gosh. Number? How big is this set? This is a really small set. 49 cards? 49. Oh, so the Wishy Washy was also a, a secret rare, technically. Oh. oh. Okay. How much is that one worth? Somehow also the same amount. It's like 600, 800 yen, and then 3,400 yen. Piplop. We want them rainbow rares, dude. Oh, apparently there's a way cooler Lunala and Solgaleo. I knew I was missing a G in there. Solgaleo. Uh, that's still really cool. Uh, let's keep that open just in case we need it again. We got three packs left. Two secret rares, though. That's that's not bad. That is not bad at all. Oh my god, I can't open this pack. A rainbow rare would be really cool. I don't think I have gotten a Japanese rainbow rare yet. I haven't opened like a whole lot, but that'd be really cool. I have a total of four rainbow rares. Three trainers worth quite a bit. And a uh, Alcremie V. Max. Ooh. 
41 out of 49. GX. Another GX card. Not bad, not bad. Still Valley, I think is his name. Pretty sure that's what it is. Oh, yeah. oh hey, I have his name. Yeah, Silva Silvali. Silval. I don't know. I really like this card. I like this super rare over the uh, the wishy washy one. For sure. Oh, jeez. All right, last one, last pack. Magic. Oh, I saw some. I saw some. But the thing is, is all the edges are hollow. Oh, oh, look at that. We got a regular Steelix to go with our. You're not as cool. You're not as cool, dude. All right, that was it for. Hi -ya. Oh, jeez. Hi -ya. Now for the big boy. I'm actually really excited for this. Um, because I have op I've opened very little Shining Fates, which sucks. But this is the precursor that everyone was hyped up about, and I got it for a pretty decent deal. I don't remember what that deal was, but pretty decent, all things considered, from StockX. I get a lot of stuff from them. Because it's basically like eBay, except the prices are a little lower, if we're being honest. Um, and it goes through StockX like authenticators, so you're a little less likely of getting scammed. Uh, which is nice, because no one likes that. And these ones are 10-packs, so this should go, this should go a lot faster. But if we pull that shiny Zard, man... All right. All right, we're gonna pick one at random. It's going in the collection. Hopefully that's not the one with the shiny Zard in it. Also, if you're watching this on YouTube, I am going to have right after this shiny, shining star V, I'm gonna open up some uh, Detective Pikachu. Not as cool, admittedly. Some people don't like it. Saw Leonhardt open up a mystery pack, and he was very disappointed that he got a uh, uh, Detective Pikachu pack. Um, but I have none, and I think they look cool, so I'm gonna open some. But also, they came with some other ones. Um, I don't, I don't know for this one, so I am going to. Go through them. So it's like a little, little ad card. That's weird. I haven't gotten these. I haven't gotten one of these. It's a little ad card. I should send this to PSA. <laughs> I already bogged down enough. All right. I think there's something. All right. We'll just go through it like normal here and see what we got. Oh my gosh. I'm going to be honest. None of their names are coming to my head. There's 330 in this set. What the hell? Why? Why is there so many in the set? Good luck to anyone trying to get a master set. There are so many shinies. Oh my god. That's what it is. You're like, just take it, make a shiny of everything, and then <laughs> flip it over. There's a full art Marnie. All right, that's what we're going for. I don't need no gold legendaries. I don't need a shiny Charizard full art Marnie. That's what I want. Okay. So we got hollow. Oh, whoa. Hollow, hollow, bolt on shiny right off the bat, dude. Nice. All right, so it's just, wait. That 
That looks... That looks... Oh! That is so cool! Okay, so the last four cards are it. So you don't have to do any shuffling. Wow, that's really nice. Right? None of those... Yeah, none of these cards do that. What the hell? What the hell? That's all... This... See, that's the thing. This is why I really hate that Shiny Face is hard to get right now. It's just fun to open. The thing being that none of these cards are, like, worth more... I was, like, you know, worth more than what they normally would go for. If that makes sense. You know? Like, everything is still, like... It's based on its rarity. I mean, it definitely looks cooler being a Shiny card, but I don't think they're, like any more rare than like V's and V maxes from other sets you know um it's really just all about the the full art trainers and the uh shiny charizard and stuff like that but it's just fun to open and get shiny card and this one two hollows a shiny card and this cool hollow which i can't get over the hollow for this it's so much fun to see like on the camera oh, i can't do it. oh It is a hollow, right? None, I could not get. Oh, I couldn't get any of the other cards to do that. I'm gonna have to look it up. I'm gonna have to look it up. But that's cool. I like it. Whatever. I'm gonna find out all the trainers from the set do that. Oh my gosh. It's like, and it's not that I'm like, we, I mean, I have, I have weak hands. I have admittedly weak hands. Oh, hello. Um, but, oh my god, more Pokemon card gym. Well, if these get you anything, you're welcome. Um, I do have admittedly weak hands. I have like bad joints. Um, but it's also about like not wanting to just completely obliterate the package. Like you're also trying to be gentle and that somehow just makes it harder. Okay, let's see. See, it's not doing it. It's, it's a special card, I'm telling you. Oh, did I sleeve those already? Ah, oh, whatever. <gasps> Amazing rare Yveltal! I like that the little... The energies are shiny too. That's sick! How much is that worth? Let's see. What number are you? 117 my third amazing rare ever Yveltal 117 oh my gosh a whole five dollars <laughs> that's fine by me it looks sick and then a standard phalanx B and then oh it's like a reverse hollow I see. Okay. That makes more sense now. So that's that's my reverse hollow. Interesting. Interesting. I'm 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 catching up. Slowly, for sure. Alright, let's pack up. Uh, I'm just gonna pack up all of them. Because I mean I'm gonna do it eventually anyway, but Oh, jeez. Eh, I won't bore. won't bore everyone with sitting here watching me put lame Pokemon cards into packages. I'll do it. I'll do it later. Reverse hollows. Hollows. Oh, that was cool. Amazing rares are cool. I know they're not, like, secret rares or anything like that, but I, I think they're cool. I just think they're neat. Okay, this one I might just be weak. I just, I can't get it. Dude, this one's made of, like, steel. Apparently, it was just the way I was opening it. That way, it was way easier. And then, there I go. I don't want to obliterate the package. Obliterates the package. Oh, my gosh. The rare expansion pass. 
add cards. All right. Hey, they're getting free advertising right now every time I put those over. But none of us can read Japanese. Hollow. I have that hollow. V Max non shiny. If you were, if you were shiny, you'd be worth so much more. Cool, nonetheless. Little ditto. Big ditto. Sorry. Huge, huge ditto. He big man. He big boy. It's weird. I have a lot of this card. I don't. I don't know why. Maybe it's I just remember it. I, don't, I just don't like the. I don't. I don't think it's like a cool card by any means. I just I feel like I see it a lot. Or I get it a lot. I don't, I don't really know. Wow, this thumb is really starting to hurt from doing this. It's admittedly easier to do it this way, so maybe I'm just opening these packs wrong. Maybe everyone's left-handed in, in Japan. Oh, I always want to, like, do a flip. Well, the goss, I know that one. Thingy, fire energy, Pultigeist, Pokemon. I have some of those, too. Boom! Shield, shield doggo V. Whatever shield Do doggo is. What is his name? Why can't I think of it? Zama Zamazenta, right? Yeah, Zacian and Zamazenta. One arguably has a much harder to pronounce name. Well, that Zamazenta is not that hard. We're just riding off this uh, shiny bolt end. Maybe it is that I'm just opening it from the wrong side. It's been much easier to open it from this side. Has that been has that been it the whole time? I've just been opening it from the wrong side. Oh, oh, Sobble. Sad man. Bunnelby have a lot of those. Rotom have a lot of those. Grizzile. I get, wait. I could guess the energy. Oh, this set comes with energy. I just realized it. I'm in my own world. Eternatus V. Nice. How much are you worth, sir? Wow. 45 cents. Sorry, 45 euro. So, like, I don't know, less than a dollar. Still cool, though. And Sobble again. God, you're so sad. So sad. I heard, I think it was, who mentioned it? I want to say it was Alex on, uh, on Twitch mentioned that Snom's face looks like a little butt. And like this one especially, it looks like a little butt with a freckle on it. Or if you like cover the eye, he's just little butt, little butt cheeks. Never can unsee it now. Can't unsee it now. He is just a little butt cheek boy. He looks exactly the same. Am I? All right, last pack magic for this set this box come on shiny jar though. mama needs a new pair of earrings carbonite electric energy obstagoon tapu coco crobabby Rippity rip. Three shinies though. Not complaining, not complaining. Complaining a little bit, but not not overly complaining. Alright. A 
I'll just put all of these together like so. I'll deal with those later. Do this. Boom. All right. So on YouTube, that's where I'm ended there for that episode. Follow the next one for these guys.